ටෙක්ගුරු ප්‍රෝග්‍රෑම් එකෙන් අද අපි ඇවිල්ලා ඉන්නේ ටිකක් වෙනස් තැනකට. අද අපි ඇවිල්ලා ඉන්නේ ඩෙල් ඊ කාර්නිවල් එකට. ඩෙල් ඊ කාර්නිවල් එකේදී උගලන්න පුළුවන් නවීන තාක්ෂණික උපකරණ ගැන දැනගන්න. ඒ වගේම නවීන තාක්ෂණික උපකරණ අත් හදා බලන්න. डेल अंतर्जा सामगम अपे आयतन लंका डेल विकुन सामगम की लंका वट अंदुना दिन अलुत्म जनरेशन मतना अलुत परंपरा डेल पउल विसी डेल फैमिली के विसी अंदुना दुन अलुत्म पउल संस्था अलुत्म सामाजिक एलिदी मे अवस्था वट ताक्षण अभी बलन विट अभी हमेलाकम ताक्षण इधरिया इंफर्मेशन टेक्नोलॉजी अहमदनता अपे परगणक लोके कालयानुकूल विवध बांड बिल्ड बट इधर पात करना अभी बहुम आडंबरे मेवस्था भी डेल अंतर्जातीय सामगम तेक् अपे लंका भी डेल विकल्प प्रमुखतम आयतने वन सोफ्लोजिक आयतने प्रथम वरट डेल पौले अहमदनता डेल फैमिली के अंदर दिन थर्टीन जनरेशन अहमदनता धातु परंपरा भी परगणक मेम होती हाँ दुनला दिन विशेष मे परगणक की वोट अभी मे हाँ दुना दत्त गबड़ाकरण उपकरण है सर्वस है अभी मूलिकोम ताक्षण गई कथाक मूलिको बलन अंग की प्याक्ति ये अंग प्रधानत्वे तम प्रोसेसर एक मे थर्टीन जनरेशन की प्रोसेसर एक विशेष मे हकीवत्ती वर्षन थ्री की खांडे प्रोसेस उदाव क्रियमट हेम सपोर्ट क्रियमट देवनी कारण मे थर्टीन जनरेशन प्रोसेस वाले विशेष मैं अविलती है मेमरी हेम मत के डीडीआर फोक टेक्नोलॉजी का ये डीडीआर फोक टेक्नोलॉजी के वे विशेष दत्त अभी दी दत्त गबड़ा के रिमेट हेम गबड़ा के दत्त आपस अभी सर्वर के पर्फॉमस मुंगाते ना मे धातुंग थर्टीन जनरेशन सर्वस्व स्पीड दारिताव सह ये दत्त हूमार करी वेगे बहुम व्यदी एक विशेष कारण आवत्तीनो मे लंका वे अट अत्युंदी फलवी वस्तावट मे विशेष मे पौले मे थर्टीन जनरेशन सर्वस्व हार्ड डिस्क विसी हया दक्व एक दत्त गबड़ा कि मे हार्ड डिस्क विसी हया दक्व मे मेशीन का सहयोग देना सपोर्ट करना ये अभी इतमत्म सतोष अद मे डेल आयतन के सोफ्लॉजि अभी मे अलू जनरेशन के अभी सामज लांकिक ईटी इंडस्ट्री कट बहुम आडंबर मे की बात करना मे मे सर्वस तमंगे अवश्य कार्य निट पास कार्य Featuring Intel Xeon processors, delivers an industry-leading server platform designed to boost application performance by moving storage closer to compute. You save significant costs with unmatched systems management, automation, and ease of use, so your business or organization runs better. Welcome to the future of systems management. So this is the way the story starts about Dell. So in 1984, there's this guy with a big dream. So that's my guy. Today we are more than 100,000 people sitting in different locations around the world. We have evolved from being a leading seller of PCs to, to being a business catalyst, providing end-to-end solutions today. While much of has changed in the transformation, much has uh, stayed the same. And we are always and will be collaborators, innovators, dreamers, and partners, and we will always have the power to do more. That's a tech thing. So the story starts uh, where Michael came out with this uh, unique idea of creating value for customers by letting letting them build their own PCs, doing it affordably, simply by removing the complexity for customers by delivering exactly what the customer 
wanted. So we all know that uh, that was a milestone in, in, in a much loved industry. Uh, that kind of changed the game. Uh, it's, it's happened to be uh, a case study um, which is kind of discussed in many uh, many forums. Um, so we are kind of proud to be a part of the the, 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 the this organization. So since then, and we we are kind of proud that we have a leader, a visionary leader, uh, heading the company today. So the iconic person. Uh, today we are a 700 billion corporation with uh, tens of millions of customers around the world, with hundreds of millions of devices and products sold around the world in billions with billions of users. That's what we are. A lot of you, the CXOs, the CIOs, people in IT, let's, let's, let's just rewind the clock, okay? When I started my career, I used to go and meet, we used to call them EDP managers or, or uh, you know, IT managers. Their job was primary to keep the lights on. Does that resonate with some of you? When you started your careers, I can see some smiles up there. Your job was, what's your real, uh, reliability? That was the first time when I used to go and sell, uh, what is it, 99% rely, reliability, what's your reliability? That's, that was a discussion. Do you actually have that discussion today? It's taken for granted. But your job was to keep it lights on. What's the paradigm shift? The shift is, that's not just, of course, you've got to keep the lights on. You've got to make sure your equipment's running efficiently. But there's a lot of technology changes that are happening. Software-defined everything. Software-defined networking. Software-defined data centers. Software-defined everything. And like you talked about Sri Lanka, are we as advanced to look at that? Good God, yes. Because some of the great solution wins we get out here. Now, there was a survey we conducted in both fast emerging markets as well as you know the US, the UK, we did Brazil, China, all across. And we talked to customers and you know with the the, the, the it's getting finalized, but the initial response is fifty-three percent of the customers will be looking at software defined data centers or networking in the next three years. Talking about shining products, I thought I'll start with our, our latest tablet range. Uh, that's a eight inch tablet working off Windows 8.1, uh, available in black and white. And as you can see, one of the best screen resolutions out there in the market. Uh, some people believe that three billion people out of I think about seven billion people have started to use some form of a compute device, whether it's a PC, whether it's a tablet, or something similar. Um, we think that the next couple of billion is what is the most exciting part. Uh, personally, I believe that the next seven billion is going to be the most exciting part. But how can that be when there are only seven billion people in the world? We're beginning to see something which many of you in this room have already experienced, but perhaps outside this room people haven't experienced it as yet, is multiple device ownership. Many of you in this room already own multiple devices, and I'm talking not about smartphones, I'm talking about compute devices. So one computer issued from the office, one possibly your personal, or you probably have an office computer, and a tablet of your own, or you probably have a personal computer, and then a tablet as well, just in case you wanna just check the news, or stock market, or weather, or something which you don't wanna boot up the machine. And so that's really exciting, because we eventually are talking about tens of billions of devices that could be used by, by the world's population in the next 10 to 20 years. And that is huge. And what's going to be driving that? Obviously data, a lot of the usage uh, patterns are changing. We were talking about printing this morning during breakfast. And we were 
challenging each other. When was it last any one of us in Dell actually printed a document for office that excludes travel ticket, that excludes a form to be printed for some regulatory work. I'm talking about pure email, PowerPoint, spreadsheet, Word document. And I must confess, it has been, I think it has been about a two to three years I have printed anything uh, for my work life. And that's amazing. For our competitors who depend on printing for their profitability, that is a huge death knell. We always talk about enabling human potential. All these pieces of technology, all the infrastructure that uh, Sumay covered just now, it would mean absolutely nothing without all the human touch. You and I, everyone in this room. And of course, expanded to a bigger room, bigger scale. It's about all the user that we have on the ground. So these are just a few um, preview, all right? That we're gonna show you that um, what's yet to come. Just think of it five years ago. Just five years ago. Things are very conventional. You talk about desktop, you talk about notebooks. It's pretty conventional. Today, I'm sure everyone in this room, right, you have pressure from across all organizations. I wanna bring my own device, I want this form factor, I want this, I want that. And to tell you what, Dell is ready for all this. In fact, um, if you look at the, I mean, some of the confidential roadmap that we have, uh, it's only exciting time to come, uh, right? So these are one of the few. Um, these are XPS 11, right? Very slim, look at this. How slim is this, right? You can actually flip it, use it as a tablet. Pretty light also. You can use it as a notebook. Um, this one um, to be launched here. Um, Venue 11 Pro. Yep, many of you would think that this is just a regular um, tablet. It's 11 inch, by the way. But it's a full functioning notebook. It can run your Excel, your office, and everything. Full productivity. It has the power of notebook in this form factor. Of course, you have a docking keyboard and all that. Something like 21 hours of battery life uh, because the keyboard has a battery underneath it. Is. So this has a battery. Obviously, that's how it's working. And then it has a battery underneath. So when you attach it, it's got two batteries. And the battery life that you get on something like this is incredible, incredible. There are some days that I don't even charge this machine and it sometimes lasts me for the entire week. Which is huge for some of us who are constantly on the machine, in the car, getting to office, coming back from office, during office, etc. just folding it, forget to charge it. This kind of a product is excellent um, and definitely the future of compute in all markets, including Sri Lanka. This one is uh, not even officially launched yet. So, uh, very high definition table that we have. Nice for you to hold around. One of the slimmest in the world. Look at how slim is this. Just look at the brightness of this. How, how details is this? Right? Uh, majority of the users will be using products like these in the near future, not like in the next five years. But many of you, when we come back in a few quarters, you will be buying these kind of products because it combines the best of both worlds. The tablets have forced us to think differently about PCs and the tablets are now thinking about how do they innovate to compete with the PC. So these products are touch screen, they are high resolution, extremely good battery life, SSD disk, so they boot up in less than 12 seconds. So gone are the days when you press power button, you go have a snack, come back, it's still spinning. Uh, now, right in front of your eyes, by the time you blink, already it's come on and it's asking for your login information. And it's very smooth operation, it attaches, and you can do anything to it, it doesn't fall off. So it's not flimsy. It's not something that you know, you've know got to be careful about. This kind of technology is what I think most people will be using, not just around the world, but definitely here in Sri Lanka. You don't need to buy a tablet and a PC. We're combining both of those technologies in one form factor. And if you were to carry this around, as you can see the shape, the form factor, the finish, and everything, it's just like a regular PC. Who knows that this could actually become a tablet that you could take for meetings, could take into conference rooms, take for customer presentation, 
so on and so forth. So Intel has introduced something called an Intel Core M processor. So I will talk about this because this is something brand new which is we launched in early September. So we have two models on the uh, Core M which is the Vipro model for the uh, corporate or the enterprise segment and we have the Core M for the individual users or the home buyers what we can call it. Uh, Vipro model actually you have, you are now you know about it like you, know, you have the virtualization and all those capabilities. So this is what we're talking about. These units are perfectly developed for twin ones and the detachables. What this means is you have longer battery life, energy efficiency, all those features has been inbuilt to it. So that's why Harjit is talking about showing the tablets so much of long or 10 hours, 15 hours, 20 hours battery life. So this is why because of the power consumption of these processors and the technology or the greater energy efficiency, this is where all these capabilities has been in built with. Lanka wage ratak kela gatta nan godak velawata vyajya gudusukanga thamai ape godak end users la egolange PCs walata egolang install karanne. Ithi me users la samanyen danna egolanta me 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 pirate softwares walin thiyena prathivipaka. Den udaharana ek egolang danna samanyen hacker kenekta ona unath puluwan egolage PC ekata pawa me enter vela egolange webcam ekin egolang karana dewal itang egolanta balanna. Ithin ape message ekak wenne metana पुलवां तरंग जेन्युइन चैनल लेकिन सॉफ्टवेयर्स लाभ आगाने की आला आपे ऑथराइज डिस्ट्रीब्यूटर चैनल लाती है ना ये तो कोटा आपे मल्टीनेशनल पार्टनर्स लाइन और डेल एचपी एवा के काटे की डायरेक्टली ये गोलांग फैक्ट्री लेवल लेके में इंस्टॉल कर ला में सॉफ्टवेयर्स लांका वटे में गोलांग गेन ඉතින් ඒ වගේ හරි විදිහට තෝරලා මේ සොෆ්ට්වෙයාස් ගන්න එක තමයි මේ එන්ඩ් යූසර්ස් ලගේ වගකීම හේතුව නැත්නම් ඒගොල්ලන් නොයෙකුත් ප්‍රතිවිපාක වලට බුදුරු වෙනවා लंकावट हंदुन ना दुन ताक्षणिक उपकरण कहीं पे आ गए ना माध्यम अभी कतार करा इतनी मेवा के ताक्षणिक लोगे अलूट अपूर्व सिद्धि मार गए ना अभी लाभने साथी थामोगे 